Hello guys, welcome back. By the way, Steam fucking sucks. So there, somebody said it. Um, remember that game, Vote Pagan Storytime, remember that game that the gods just had to have on the winter sale? And I said, this is too much. Let's wait. I'm getting an idea. It'll be even cheaper a little down the line because I was seeing a lot of reviews of this game really is nothing. They whined and howled. I got it. I really didn't fucking like it. I was upset. You guys know I get panic attacks. I said, I really don't like how much we paid for this title. I'm really upset like this. And you, you can feel panic attacks starting. And I'm like just about to be peeled off the ceiling by the old man now. And Asmodeus asked me to play it a little today. And I went to play it. And I said, at least let me comfort myself by going to see other people bitch this game out. Guess what? It's on sale for even cheaper than I paid for it. And I just, you know, crazy, panicky, bleh. And I went to request a refund, and of course they denied me. So uh, the gods told me they were blocking me, because Asmodeus thinks it's his game, and Loki thinks it's his game. And didn't I think they were worth, you know, the money? And I was just freaking out about this. I was like having a total freak out. And I said, you don't understand. This was way too much money. And these other games that you all insisted I get turned out to be shit that won't even work. You have spent way too much of my money. I'm heading right into a panic attack. And, you know, the thing is, I went and I found out how to request a refund when you have been denied a refund. So I went and I went to the help desk and I asked for a refund. And I said, please do not leave me with this game. I truly did not realize when I got it, it was abandoned where it has been worked on for since last May. You know, I even attended to repurchase it at the the cheaper price. Will you please help me out? They will not. They will not. Um, they told me no. They told me you've played it over two weeks. We are absolutely not giving you a refund. And I just, I fucking flipped out is Odin Sol and Od Loki and Asmodeus are both banned from the house because they admitted to get in the way of the refund and I guys I had offered them more games when I went back with the money I said I will go back and fucking buy it for you in an instant I will fucking buy it for you in an instant and I will get you more games with it I'm even offering because I'm trying to get this done I even offered to go spend more money because that's that'll make sense on pizza and chicken and everything, you know? They would not help me, would not help me. So I just start going nuts, and Odin's like, they need to be out of this house. I don't know what the fuck's wrong with those two today, but the fuck out. So Asmodeus and Loki are both banned for, from the house, and I I got calmed down by the old man, actually. So for all of you that hate him, he is useful. <laughs> And, you know, sometimes the gods are like that. They're not perfect. They're not sitting on a cloud in Nirvana. Sometimes they're bitchy and they're mean and they're cruel. And they made it all about the money I'd spent on this. And I said, guys, I don't feel comfortable. I still don't feel comfortable. I think it was too much. This is beyond my comfort zone. So now I'm stuck with this piece of shit. And I'm just really upset. And you guys can tell. I'm like near hysterical tears. And I'm like, I don't know why the fuck you did this to me. But you two are mean shits out of my house. So I'm not going to be working with those two for a while. And sometimes Loki does mean bitchy stuff like this because our gods aren't perfect. Sometimes they're just downright fucking cruel for reasons that we can never discern. And I, I said to Odin, I said, I'm really upset now. I said, I'm really hysterical. I said, you know, it's going to take me time to calm down. And he knows it. Because he knows that was way too much money for something that was broken. And he knows that in a just and fair society, I would have got my fucking money back. Because I said, I will even buy this game when I asked for the refund the second time. I said, I will rebuy this game and I will spend the rest of the money. So I wasn't like I was going to get my money back and go do something crazy like buy food. I was going to buy more video games. So I'm just really upset right now. But, you know, sometimes the gods can be cruel to us and sometimes they can be downright shit to us. And, you know, Asmodeus was trying to make it about it's a luxury product because you paid more. No, it's a fucking broken shit product that overheats and almost destroyed my computer, but they won't give me my money back. So, steam fucking blows, and so do the gods. <laughs> I just, I'm just upset. But I told you guys, I would keep it real. I would tell you the good and the bad and the ugly. Today's a very ugly day. Today's like one of those days where the gods know I have anxiety attacks, they know I have panic attacks. And they know that the worst possible thing to do is to push me beyond my limits. And I have been upset about this game this whole time. 
I haven't been comfortable. It's too late now. I will officially never get my money back. I asked twice. They're not giving me my money back. I'm stuck with this piece of shit. So I fucking hate Steam with a passion. Because all the other games I bought were shitty too. And they were fucking broken. And I'm like, Steam does this all the time. They fucking take our money. They have to know this content's fucking broken. And they just don't give two shits. Because they just want your money. You know? So I'm fucking pissed off at Steam. Because that was... You know, what, what good are fucking really cheap games that don't even fucking run? They're worth absolutely nothing. They don't give two shits about people. So I'm really, really upset and being pulled off the ceiling by Odin. And I said, well, I have one bundle of bundles left. I'm wondering, I didn't play it. I said, I'm wondering if I, you know, I have one bundle while the bundle of bundles left. I said, I think I should just take that back because I'm having a panic attack. And I spent my money and I said, this isn't about trust. This is about if you push a human too far during the teaching relationship, Chris will have a fucking meltdown and we'll go and we'll regress to way back before we even were. So it's not a good day. Loki was really shitty. Asmodeus was really shitty. I don't know why. Sometimes they do this shit and they're just super mean to you. And there's never a good reason for it. There's never a good reason for your teachers to be cruel. So I'm sorry that wasn't as upbeat as usual, but, you know, it was something that was bothering me. And, you know, I don't think they're worth just everything they demand. I don't care if they're gods or not, or they're your teachers or their spirit energy or whatever. I think they can be very cruel and very wrong at times, and I will point it out when I think they have. Which is why I told you about the gift of blasphemy. Fuck them both. I don't want them in my house for a while. So... If you guys like what you see, like, comment, subscribe, and I will see you later. Bye-bye.